Hello everyone and welcome back to another a fantastic chess game from 2014 this time in a chess tournament in Germany and in this chess game we have Fabiano Caruana with the white pieces and his opponent is Ruslan Ponomaryov who is a chess grandmaster from Ukraine and Fabiano Caruana needs no introduction especially if you're a chess fan around our times Fabiano Caruana he was the World Chess Championship challenger and many times candidate, one of the strongest chess grandmasters from the United States. And before he was from Italy, now he is representing the United States. So let's see what happened in this chess game. This is a fantastic chess game. So I'm going to show you the opening moves. There is nothing out of the ordinary. So this is the Petrov defense, also known as the Russian game. Developing the pieces and opening the defile. Pretty aggressive opening by Caruana, castling from the queen side, and black is castling. He is going to castle also from the queen side. And this looks like a very interesting position, but let's check out the key moment at the uh, the key moment of this chess game. Uh, so rook over and then bishop takes on h3, attacking the bishop, and the material is equal. So pushing the pawn. Queen in, defending the rook, and then in this position, Caruana made an important decision and he played queen to c6. He is leaving the g pawn but attacking the d pawn. So black is defending with the most passive move possible, bishop to e6, and in this position, maybe attacking the g pawn uh, by black. And how to defend the g pawn? Black is defending the d pawn, but the computer analysis showed that bishop to b7 was the better move. So, queen to f6 and we are playing chess. According to the computer chess engine, bishop to b7 was the better move. But in the real game, we have bishop to e6. And this looks like a very boring and a very passive move by Ponomaryov. And in this position, it is white to move. What would you do? Well, the first move is g6, pushing the g-pawn and if capturing the pawn, Capturing the bishop, so this is undermining the bishop. And what else? Rook to g7 and then capturing the pawn, so black has to capture back with the bishop. This is attacking the bishop. Bishop takes on f7 and it is white to move. What would you do in this position? So this is the key moment of this chess game. One of the key moments of this chess game and try to guess the next move of Fabiano Caruana. He played a spectacular move. Can you see the idea of Caruana? Which is not very easy to see. It is not so easy to see at first. But let me give you a couple of seconds. If you need, you can always pause the video and try to guess the next move of Fabiano Caruana. But let me give you a small tip. If, if, if white can bring the rook on e7, attacking on c7 that is going to be very difficult to defend and white is going to have a very good position well this is what Caruana played rook to e7 anyway so the queen can take the rook isn't this just simply losing the rook did you see this move and did you see the idea most importantly can you see the follow-up well what else white is attacking on c7 so if king up, then bishop to a6 and defending is very difficult. So queen takes on e7, accepting the sacrifice. And now can you see the idea of Fabiana Caruana? Why did Caruana play rook to e7? What was his idea? Let me give you a couple of seconds. Again, if you need, you can pause the video. I'm going to wait for three seconds and then I'm going to show you the move. Well, let me give you a tip. Fabiano Caruana... With playing rook to e7, he is basically deflecting the queen and this allows a very nice move. Can you see the move? Okay, so this is the move. Bishop to a6 and how on earth are you going to stop queen to b7? Check, mate. What a move, what a move. Well, black didn't resign because black wanted to see this beautiful checkmate capturing the bishop. But now, rook a queen to a8 check mate checkmating the king so after rook to e7 that is deflecting the queen and then allowing to checkmate the king 
What an incredible, amazing checkmate by Fabiano Caruana. And what do you think about this amazing checkmate? So thank you very much for watching and I hope to see you next time. Take care and bye bye.